What's up? It's Brad. Melanie Martinez is here. She just performed in Click 98.9's non-acoustic lounge? I guess. How, how much acoustic was in the performance? Um, none. Which made it awesome because no one expected it. Everyone's like, oh, we're going to come see someone with a guitar, which is what we normally do. Um, and she just came out and, and brought the, the full kit. It was really cool. Um, I was the leaning on the piano. I feel like I was yeah, you have to. Right now yeah. <laughs> 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 so you haven't been on the national stage for very long. Do you think that is good or bad as far as you moving forward? Um, I think it, I, I don't know. I think it's good. I'm like doing my own thing and um, I don't know. I, I'm having more fun playing original music and kind of just exploring and traveling. What's your definition of cheating? Of cheating? Like in what, in what way? Like, like you have a significant other, what's your def oh. definition of cheating? I mean, anything, really. Like, not anything, but, like, I think that, like, um, I don't know. I mean, kissing, obviously, and, like, if you're, like, I mean, flirting, I don't know how to explain it. Like, I feel like there's, like, a certain extent. Like, you can't, like, I feel like getting attached and, like, having actual feelings for someone is, like, cheating. You're, like, emotionally cheating, even if you didn't do anything, you know? So that. It's funny, but Heather, the, my co-host on my show, asked this question to everyone. Yeah. And it's interesting for me to see the range of answers we get. So it's like, oh. What is the weirdest answer you've gotten on that? I'm curious. Not the weirdest. Not the, I mean, weirdest as in, like, the most far out, like, oh, kissing is okay. Like, have you gotten that? Cause I what think was that, the? I think that's weird. Coke Low was cool with anything. She said relationships. So <laughs> like, fluid. What? It's kind of funny. Coke is the freest sexually. If you can't hear that, she's saying Tovlo's sexually free. <laughs> um, also, uh, Rin Weaver kind of said the same thing. Yeah, Rin basically said sex. Rin and Adele said penetration. Yeah, Adele was like, what do you mean, kissing or something? That's not, that doesn't count. So it was very interesting. I wonder what she would feel it now, though. She has a kid. Um, so that's your definition of cheating. Pretty much anything that feels like that doesn't. If you're, like, emotionally attached to someone, I feel like that. I mean... I guess it's different than if you like. I don't know. I don't really. I don't. I have, I'm not the best at answering this question. Are you emotionally <laughs> attached to anyone? My boyfriend. Yes. <laughs> What's his name? What? Are you, guys cheating? Are you cheating right now? Hey, are, no, With my presence? No, no, no. Oh. Okay, good. He's he's an accepting he's an accepting person. Is that him? <laughs> yeah, that's my. Oh, come over here, dude. My boyfriend is my drummer. Come, come over here. here. <laughs> I didn't know. Come over. Sit on my lap. Sit on his lap. Come on, sit right here. Sit on his lap. I'm just kidding. Sit on my lap. Are we all three going to sit here? All right. Hey, you yeah. killed it today on the drums. Thank you. Well, on the, what do you call it? <laughs> pad. The pad. This is really comfortable. Yeah. Nice. Cozy. This is cozy. This um, is what's your definition of cheating? Whatever she said. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I would like to know this. I'm curious. Um, I don't know. <laughs> It's something that I would never do, so, you know, it's just <laughs> not even in my vocabulary. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so for, what's your name again? Miles. Miles? Pile. Pile. That's not your real last name. No, no, his name That would Piles. be absurd. We call him Piles. It's not Miles Piles. It's not Miles Piles. Piles. I call, we all oh, call okay. him Piles. Everyone calls him Piles. Piles. You got him. Piles. There's other people behind the camera. <laughs> they just yell things. Um, okay, so what's a white lie that you tell? We'll start with Piles. Um, white lie. When, so she is really in the vintage clothing and toys. So if she finds a store that she likes and she comes back with like 10 bags <laughs> and she's like, I went too nuts. Like I'm a terrible person. Like I can't believe I got all this stuff. Like I'm not even going to use it. I'm always like, no, it's, it's fine. You're going to, that's a white lie. Like you're good. Sense. Like you didn't, you didn't, you didn't really go all out. Like you'll find a place for all of it. But really I'm like, damn. Like you just, <laughs> <laughs> I love you saying that when they're sitting right there. Like, what about you? A white lie you tell? Um, that, uh, uh, hmm. I don't know. I don't lie. I don't even, I don't tell lies. Liar. <laughs> um, I don't know. I don't really, I, I don't really think about my, my lies. <laughs> Is that, you lie that much? I believe, I believe my lies. That's how... She's that's very straightforward. She doesn't really... 
She's not it. In the Don't tell a white lie like, like, oh, I didn't get your text. Or something, I mean, like, something like that. We, we had Doug Baldwin from the Seahawks was like, I tell everybody that I'm six foot. And then I was like, well, how tall are you? He was like, six foot. It's pretty funny, actually. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> so no white lies? Not really. I mean, nah. Yeah, I, I pretty much tell it like it is. Pick one current artist um, that you've never covered before that you think you would either A, love to cover, or B, work with. Never covered before. See, I can't say The Weeknd. I would love to work with The Weeknd, but I have covered one of his songs very badly. I did a bad job, but I tried. Usually when I do a bad job, we just erase it and it doesn't count. Okay, so I guess it didn't count, so The Weeknd. Sweet. <laughs> Name one Michael Jackson song you would remake. Ben. <laughs> That's a great choice. I would have gone with Dirty Diana, but that was pretty oh, good. Oh, well, The Weeknd yeah. did Dirty Diana. And it was We're great. not talking about The Weeknd right now. We're talking okay, about Michael sorry. Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> you two are great. I love you. I would totally hang out with you when you turn 21. How old are you? Uh, 26. Whoa! <laughs> Let's talk about ages. Ages. Is it weird being 26 dating a 19-year-old? Uh, it was a thing at first. It was totally a thing, but she is not like any other 19 year old which i knew off the bat but it was something at first i was like damn this is i just can't crazy. get into any bars but then i i realized while i was thinking that i was hanging out with a lot of my other 26 year old friends 36 year old friends i was like wow these people are pretty stupid and like she's got her stuff together more than oh yeah no, a lot of I, other people and it's yeah. weird. most of her friends are already i mean she has friends from Literally, I'm not joking, from two years old to 90 years old. <laughs> and they hang. Like, she'll talk about, like, two year old hang? Legos I, or yeah. whatever. Yeah. I mean, I literally have, like, a, one of my, like, really good friends is two years old. So, yeah. And also, I have a 60 year old friend who's really great. I love these two. I want to put them in my pocket. <laughs> um, I just turned 28, and I was thinking about my friend of mine who is 37 and called to borrow money the other day. And um, he was like, he's like, hey, man, I'm a little short on rent this month. I was like, you've been short on rent for 37 years. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Not paying your rent this month. Sell another mini. Um, I'm Brad. That's Melanie Martinez. Just piles. That's Piles. <laughs> <laughs> I, have to wait, I have to tell you about this. One of my really, really, really good friends is Vicky Martinez. Okay. She actually introduced me to my fiance, and my daughter's middle name is after her. But it was funny. We mentioned that you were coming on the radio. And someone called up and was like, don't you mean Vicky Martinez? <laughs> oh, <laughs> my like, God. No, the other person from The Voice that has the last name Martinez. Have you ever met Vicky? Yes, actually. When? Uh, at the rap party um, in the ending of The Voice. Yeah. She's crazy. Yeah, she's awesome. She's really cool. She's the best. Yeah. Brad, Melanie, Piles, <laughs> Click 98.9. <laughs> Heather's back there. Are we done yet? America. Nah. <laughs>